welcome you guys to Business Talks with Pop Evil. Today's <laughs> discussion is going to be uh, business ethics. Yes. Ethics. How does your band make it in the biz? I don't know. I don't have any info for you. Just figure it out. It's, it's just a credit to hard work. And I think with Footsteps, it was such a big risk at the time when we all put it together that um, it's not like we wrote the song and everyone was like, yeah, this is it. You know, it was, it was it was a bit of a process and it was a big risk for the band doing something new. So to have it all kind of come full circle today is, is a huge credit to the risk we took as a band and as a team. And Congratulations, you know, guys. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Chachi. Thank you, team. Team one. The but, golf uh, club. Fantastic. It was, uh, it was good, man. We're excited. Definitely that's def something we don't want to take for granted. And hopefully, you know, there's, there's more to come. <laughs> It was like our first green screen experience where, you know, we've done bits and pieces here and there, but like where the entire video was green screen from start to finish. So we really had to trust uh, the artistic vision of the director and, and things like that and like where he saw things going and, and we got little you know, snippets of things back and forth with him. But, you know, with everything being done in post, it's kind of scary to go in there and just perform in front of a green screen and hope for the best, you know, but we're really happy with the way it turned out. Take these footsteps, go higher, go higher. Yeah, it was pretty crazy though to yeah. see the evolution of you know what we saw happening. Yeah. Uh, and the, basically, a, there were a lot of individual performances put pieced together. So it's really hard just like to watch one person stand in front of a wall and basically play guitar and like, oh, this is going to be a pretty cool video, right? Yeah. <laughs> and then to see the final product, that's exciting. I think, you know, kind of going into the process, there was there was definitely some pressure, you know, thinking about how we're going to top Onyx and, you know, all that kind of stuff. But then when I actually got in there, you know, it was it was just, it was free, it was open. It was um, a really collaborative effort, so it was just, everyone just went in there and made music and we just kind of forgot about the pressure. There's not really any set formula that we have. I mean, I think we showed up. Some people had, like, as little as literally one guitar riff. Some things, sometimes Dave will bring, like, a finished song for us. Sometimes Nick will bring a finished song. Matt had three really ideas that were just kind of jammy and ended up evolving and becoming like album favorites. Uh, so it's kind of like everything and anything in between. Sometimes it's the smallest idea spawning the whole idea in studio. Sometimes we make up the idea while we're in studio and the song makes the record, just you get inspired. Um, but Onyx, I remember making like S five or six really good songs we feel strongly about and like then kind of being like all right let's finish the record and this record was like we tracked 20 songs yeah, and did. i was like sad to cut a lot of yeah, them we had a lot like finished songs and we're like uh we can't put these all on the record and i was like oh so i'm gonna miss something <laughs> i enjoy playing every song we have off the new record so far personally it's just it's fun, it's refreshing, I feel like artistically it kind of taps into areas that we haven't before. And so, some nights we get people, you know, you see people in the crowd that obviously have bought the record and know some of the new songs, and other nights we get a lot of people that are just watching, and that's okay. It's different for us, we have to accept that. I think, you know, you get kind of uh, confident and reliant, like Onyx, the hits off that people know the words, and so they sing it back to you, but when we play something like Ghost of Muskegon off the new record, not everyone has even heard the song yet, so you're like waiting for them to give you all their energy and the words, and they're still like digesting and listening, but I love playing the new stuff, man. Yeah, it's fun, it's got a, it's got a kind of different groove than our past material, so it's just fun to play. What's up, y'all? We are Pop, Pop Evil. Evil. Subscribe to Louder Noise. The loudest noise on Earth. Ah! Such annoying sound. <laughs> he dropped the mic. <laughs>